the parent movement, okay, that really didn't start at all until 1950. And it really wasn't until the 1960s. And it became known that President Kennedy, JFK, had a sister with mental retardation, and Eunice Shriver was very vocal in talking about that. That made it easy for parents who had been stigmatized themselves to come out and to admit they had a child with a mental retardation and to say, we're not going to accept traditional practices. We're not going to accept warehousing. Advocacy organizations like the Association for Retarded Children, now called the ARC, worked with parents to try to improve conditions at the institutions. But it was an uphill battle. It was a dirty little secret of professionals and, and researchers. They kind of knew that the conditions were bad, but they didn't do anything about it. They accepted it. 